everyone, welcome back to CBO Wellness, Chill Vibes Only. My name is Allie and today's video is going to be about the two components of sexual difficulties and how to address and fix them both. So sexual difficulties is basically the inability to, you know, feel desire and to want to have sex. Um, you know, maybe mentally you're there, but physically you just can't get your body there. And so when that happens, there's usually two components that are playing into it. And so in order to turn off the sexual difficulties or correct the sexual difficulties, you have to address these two components. So the first component of sexual difficulties is lack of desire or the lack of wanting to engage in a sexual activity. Um, so oftentimes the lack of sexual desire can stem from many different stresses in our lives. Uh, and it can be quite frustrating because, you know, maybe you do want to have sex and you do want to feel desire towards your partner. And mentally you're there and you really want to do that, but physically you just can't get there. Like you can't bring yourself to actually do the act. And that has to do a lot with our accelerators and our brakes. So that's the first component. So basically, you know, you want to have sex maybe, but your body's physically not turned on. And then the second component of sexual difficulties is the shame and guilt that comes after that. So the shame and guilt of not being able to have sex with your partner or not wanting sex or not being able to perform or not being able to get your body to a place where you can engage in sexual activities. And the two of those basically together just completely shut down your ability to engage sexually and can make you feel super overwhelmed and really frustrated. And so I want to talk about a simple way to kind of combat those two components to help you um, get over sexual difficulties. Now, the first one, like I talked about, it has to do with your accelerators and your brakes. So we have to first think about, okay, like what is going on for me right now in my life that's causing me not to feel turned on? Um, so am I stressed, you know, do I not feel safe with my partner? Am I not getting sexually satisfied by these experiences? Do I feel pressured to have sex? These are all things that can affect our ability to want to engage in a sexual activity. And until we address each of those concerns head on, we're not going to be able to take our foot off the brake and accelerate. So I have tons of videos on how to like address sexual desire issues. Um, mindfulness is one of them. Communication with your partner, using sex toys, figuring out how to make sex an enjoyable experience for you are all on the list there. So I highly recommend checking those out. But while you're working through that, something that you need to practice is dropping the shame and guilt that comes along with it. Because as long as you apply labels to what you're going through and you judge yourself for it, you're not going to be able to move forward. So, you know, we are not our thoughts. We just simply observe our thoughts. Um, we are our actions. So, you know, if you're having the thought of like, oh, like I'm a horrible partner because I haven't had sex with my partner in, you know, X amount of time and they're going to leave me and, you know, all of this negative shame and guilt and blame, you need to learn how to talk yourself down from that and say like, okay, right now I'm feeling super guilty and shameful about this. This isn't a feeling that really serves me. This is not something that I want to carry forward. And I would rather, you know, look at this in a different light. So maybe I'm going to take this and think to myself, you know, my body right now is cueing to me that something else is off and something's not right here. And it's all it's trying to do is help me figure that out so I can actually enjoy this experience and start to want to crave this experience um, like my partner. So I'm not going to feel bad about this. I'm going to get curious. I'm going to try some new things and I'm going to take sex off the table. I'm going to take this guilt and shame and put it in a box and say, hey, you know, thank you for showing up for me, but you're not exactly the most helpful thing right now. And instead I want to focus on maybe my mindfulness practice, or I want to focus on building a deeper bond with my partner, or communicating to them about what I've been going through. Um, these are all things that we can do to help us, you know, move forward and not stay stuck in those thought patterns. So those are the two components to sexual difficulties. It's likely if you're having trouble with sex right now, you're experiencing one or both of those. Um, and I really, really recommend you take the time to kind of dive in deeper, drop the guilt and the shame, and get curious with yourself and curious with your body. 
Uh, we have tons of resources on this channel that you can check out for helping increase sexual desire. Um, so definitely give those a watch. And if you have any questions, feel free to DM me at CVO Wellness. I'm always happy to help. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe because that really helps this channel. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for another video shortly.